It's Miranda. I am officially 43 today. It is one in the morning and everybody else is asleep. But now that I'm 43, I am older and wiser. So there's that. Also, somebody once asked about how I started a YouTube channel. I started trying to make this channel work years ago. I want to say, how many years has it been now? So I attempted to do a video September 7th, 2015. I did September 9th, September 10th, September 23rd, September 28th. But things were happening and my brain just wasn't in the right place for it, unfortunately. You know, passings and just major events. Um, I would get into it, but I just, I don't, I honestly don't feel like it because it's my birthday and I don't feel like being a downer. Um, but I did start the channel back up uh, September 25th, 2019. Seems like September is a thing for me. Oh, I'm going to take this out. One thing I love about my hair at this length is that it just, it just wants to cooperate. 2019. The reason why I posted that video is because for months ahead of that, I had been considering starting a channel. I thought of things. Um, I wrote that I don't know what I'm doing thing down and scribbled it out. And I liked it. I took a picture of it and everything. And I, I had the idea to do stuff like that. And then one day, I was in the house by myself. My son was in school. My husband was at work. And I, I don't remember, I think there was a lull at work or I wasn't working that day, something. It wasn't an hour that I was working. But I suddenly just got in my head and started feeling very, I felt a lot of pressure and I felt like I was going to fail my son and just all the things. I felt like I felt them all at once and I was so frustrated. And you know, that thing, ha that stuff happens all the time, just all, all the emotions. And as I started to calm myself down, as I started talking to myself about it, I was like, wait, I don't want to talk to myself. I was like, I want to record it. And if I feel like I got out what I needed to get out, I'll post it. And that's what happened. And then I didn't really want to keep posting videos like that, but I just wanted to break the ice for myself, basically. So after I did that, um, you know, a couple of people reached out and were like, are you okay? <laughs> uh, sometimes no, but I'm a, hu a human being who just has some mental health ups and downs. And so I posted an update saying I look terrible, but I'm okay. And just to alleviate some of that. After that, I didn't really know what to post. So I figured let's post me singing a Lady Gaga song because I used to get told I looked like her all the time. And then while I was singing it, I felt like the throat flutters. I felt myself getting anxious. And I was so surprised. And instead of like cutting the video off, I just said it in the video. I was like, oh, I started getting nervous. I was like, you know, I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna do that. It's like, I'm not gonna reveal everything. I'm not gonna do all the, every personal thing in my life. I'm not, that's what I did. I just figured whenever I felt like recording, I would record. And if I felt like I could edit it and make it entertaining enough, that I thought it was amusing and I enjoyed it, then I would post it. So that's what I've been doing. I'm always so scattered. This is scattered, but um, if I go back even further, 
I would um, grab this. It was a big Panasonic VHS recorder, camcorder. You know, it was really big. It had a big hand thing right there, just a big thing right there. Just, it was a big camera. It was loud. It was, but it was great, and I would use it to film Barbie soap operas. I tried to do talk shows with my cousins. So I would record a lot of videos like that. I did a lot of very random, very random things on camera. Had YouTube been a thing in the late 90s, in the late 80s, early 90s plus, I would have been all over it. So there have been setbacks in life, unfortunately, and it caused me a lot of trauma and pain. A lot of other things have happened too. And sometimes my brain has a really hard time processing some things. I don't like the word processing, it makes me sound like a computer, but sometimes I feel like one. It just took me a while, a long time, to finally get back to where I wanted to start just making stuff like this, silly stuff that I thought was funny. I feel like I wanted to do something like this for myself. You know, when I have the chance, when I'm able to. I was never trying to be anything. But I think when I first did my channel back in 2015, I thought I was supposed to. I'm one of those people who can watch myself. I still think I'm cringy. I still think I'm kind of ridiculous, but I don't mind. I'm just like, whatever. I'm like, it's still amusing. And if I find it the least bit amusing, maybe somebody else will. When you're young, you want to think you know a lot of stuff. And I think I, you know, I think I knew a decent amount more than people gave me credit for. But at the same time, you get older and you're like, oh, yeah, I didn't really get that. You know? There have been a lot of birthdays around now. I did not realize how many Tauruses there were. Okay, this is horoscope.com, and today is horoscope for Taurus. April 30th, 2022. You face a day of some conflict, Taurus. Nevertheless, the Discord will prove quite useful. This is probably one of the best opportunities in recent weeks to become aware of some family matters. These matters may have been occurring behind your back for some time now. News about a bit of past personal history could surprise you, and perhaps even upset you for a short time. Not, to, not today. The conflict I was thinking while I started reading that was Donovan was a little cranky because he's been sick. So I figure I'm probably going to get sick and he's a little cranky. Then again, I don't really believe in these. I'll let you know if it comes true. I think I'm actually going to try to go to bed now. So. Thank you for watching, and I'm going to try to sleep so I can actually enjoy my birthday tomorrow without being exhausted. Bye.